all it is, Miles. A leap of faith. Like, what's up, danger? Like, what's up, danger? Like, what's up, danger? Jeez, that's what you're talking about, though. Like... Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel and thank you for joining me. So, I didn't want to talk about this topic because I ain't gonna lie. My channel is pretty much a controversial channel. It, it is. It is. I, I have to admit it. You get what I'm saying? Because I talk about the things that most people don't want to talk about. And I speculate a lot and... I just pretty much say what's on my mind, which is somewhat frowned upon in today's society. I'm basically shooting myself in the head. This is America. If all y'all decide to go with a lot of this bullshit, then I will be looked at as an outcast because of these videos that I'm making right now. The way everything looks. I should probably save myself and jump ship, but mmm. Right, what's up, danger? But if I do that, then I'll be, I'll be, I'll be no better than the people that I'm fucking talking about in this video. I will become a hypocrite, and that's fake. That's fake. So I gotta make this video. Even though I don't want to really just talk about this subject, I know it's controversial. I know it's controversial. I want to talk about something that's interesting, something that, you know, people enjoy talking about, like movies and things like that, you know, something like some escapist entertainment. I would love to, but I can't because of the, this dumb shit. We got too much dumb shit going on, man, and as a crusader for justice, you don't know Malcolm X. You know Denzel Washington is Malcolm X. You know nothing about Malcolm X. Malcolm X was a bisexual male prostitute for white men. You would probably know that if you weren't trying to deflect. Even back. Not no justice warrior. No, a crusader for truth. I'ma say, oh, I can't even. I I I tell the truth. Okay, I'm not fucking Brian Stubbs. So I tell the fucking truth. So yes, I am a crusader. For truth. You get what I'm saying? I gotta tell this subject. You get me? I gotta talk about this shit. You get me? You know why? Because I'm fighting for truth. Okay? And the truth is... I'm tired of seeing this transgender shit. Okay? Sort of thrown um, into question. And so that was a very difficult experience. But... In... Continuing to swim uh, after transitioning has been an incredibly rewarding experience as I can continue to do the sport I love as my authentic self. And that experience in swimming um, and basically being in a swimsuit 20 hours a week um, has sort of helped me um, with accepting my body as it is and being proud and comfortable in my body and in who I am. I'm tired. I'm tired of it. Oh my God, why are y'all opening Pandora's box and letting Pandora's balls come out? Do you get what I'm saying? Why are y'all letting these men's balls fall out through their suits and shit just because they declare themselves fucking girls? <laughs> I don't want to live in that world. I don't want to live in this world where we got fuck got to pretend that someone is a girl when they're a guy. You get me? Or pretend like they're a, they're a guy when they're a girl. You get what I'm saying? Why are we doing this to ourselves? Why? How, how much evidence do you need? You get what I'm saying? How, why? Why? Why are women losing to men? But the answer to that question should have no consequence on legislations or laws. Because for example, suppose it's suppose it said it's purely biological, okay? 
then you say, oh, that explains it. That poses says it's purely psychological. What are you going to do now? You say, well, now you can, you're going to go to the, 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 the reorientation camps or whatever those are called, where they realign you because they say it's psychological rather than biological. All of a sudden, people start behaving in ways in society that want to constrict the freedom of expression of who and what people are. And that is a danger. So maybe there needs to be a line in the sand. Let science do what it does. But politicians keep us free. Yet there's so many politicians that are doing the opposite of that. So why are you a libertarian? I, I, don't, I don't even know who to root for anymore. You get what I'm saying? Should I, should I, should I, uh, should I, should I root for women's rights so that they take them rights and turn men into women? Should I root for men being women so that they can turn around and take away what is a woman? That motherhood starts way beyond the biological event. And anyone, including men, can mother no. and play no. the role of a men, mother. Father. Um, Piers, would you... Women, mother, that's, the, that's because the, the, the titles are male and female titles. Okay, with respect, would you look into the face of a man that has just lost his wife and is really struggling to play the role of the mother and the father and say that to him? Yeah. So you're not a mother. He's the father. That child, well, you might be more sensitive in those circumstances. You still call him a father. playing the role of the mother because... That was me, I'd be a father. I wouldn't suddenly morph into a mother. Again, with respect, to mother and to father are not gender-specific. They are gender-specific. Why are we pretending the otherwise? Or oh, I just say fuck, fuck that whole side. Just fuck that whole side. You get me? I know y'all stupid. That's how dumb y'all are. Look, we're look, look. I don't really want to talk about this, man. But you basically making us go up against retarded people after you have declared these people precious. You get what I'm saying? Everybody's precious now. You get what I'm saying? Oh, oh, don't offend that person. Don't offend that person. Can't say that. Can't say this. Gotta be good. AA has said nothing. Again, University of Pennsylvania refers the girls for therapy to get over their upset. This is this is par for the course, is it not, Nancy? Like, it's somebody else's problem. No one has the courage to speak out. As if we're, we're going to pretend there's no way of speaking out without being sensitive. Yes, someone is going to get, get a little upset. But right now, they've just settled on, well, it's going to be the girls. And too bad. Gotta make sure everybody's happy. Don't you get it? When everybody is happy... No one will be happy when everybody is miserable. Some people find happiness. I I scratch that last part. That last part is stupid. But yeah, we're we're talking about this this chick, uh, Leah Thompson. Thompson. Supposedly Leah Thompson uh has or is having uh complications uh as a girl. He he wants to he wants to swim with the girls. And now he's making girls uncomfortable. But the girls can't say anything about it because they don't want to go against the people who help them with their fight. They gotta continue fighting for the people so that those people can continue fighting with them. So they can't go against them. Even though they hurt themselves by protecting those people. You get me? You know that that's a man, but you can't say anything. Nothing. Why? This is America. Because it might hurt their feelings. Why? Because the mental retarded person might get mad. Why? Malcolm X was a bisexual male prostitute. For what? Because the retarded person is sad. We don't want to make retarded people sad. We got to be nice and kind. You see how stupid this dumbass world is becoming? Y'all tearing down books. Y'all hiding words. Google is fucking lying to y'all about the definitions and descriptions of things now. You get me? It's just censor everything. Nobody can say nothing. You're basically putting yourselves in concentration camps. You're putting yourselves in concentration camps. You're already slaves. You get me? Why? Because you have to guard your words. There's no freedom there. Why? Because you have to move a certain way. You got to wear a mask. There's no freedom there. 
You get me? Y'all tight. Y'all already giving up everything that y'all that we're supposed to have naturally. Our free will, all these things. No, why? Because you have to lie all the time. We're look, they're making us fucking heathens. We lie constantly now. Nobody tells the truth anymore. Why? Because truth is hurtful. Topic that's a hot button topic, and you bring scientific methods and tools to it. See, we don't trust. I'm, I'm interpreting here. I think we as a society don't trust that people in charge in a free country won't try to legislate something that will constrict people's freedoms in the face of that information. I think that's the fear. Well, isn't that... It's a fear. I mean, and isn't that... We don't trust our own ability to govern ourselves in the face of what could be some information relative to other what? other kinds of information. Isn't that a bit of a problem? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's not, it means it's not a free society. It's not a society of free inquiry. Dangerous. Insulting. You get me? Tell some trans woman that she's a man, call a man a woman when he's a, uh, when he's a man, uh, or, or say anything that somebody deems offensive. Now y'all talking about rape so much, you think everything is rape. You get me? No matter what it is. It, why do we even associate with anybody anymore? Why can't I just not kill you? I started screaming, and I said, there's a rope around my neck. Think about that. You get me? Because the contract of truce that we had amongst these people, I would help you, we would keep each other safe, but I can't continue that contract anymore because you have terminated the truce between men, between women. You have made it to where there is no reason to associate with anybody because that in itself is a lie. All you are is another animal. And then to to progress in this society, I should just eliminate you. You don't see that? Well, everybody loves you. You're confronted by a trans woman. You're going to hide it. Everybody loves it. No, they I don't think so. They take pictures of it. They post it. Uh -huh. Nine out of ten customers love it. Yeah, you know what? It's bullshit. No, what you're spouting is bullshit. Uh, no, it's not. Trans it women are women, sir. That sign is bullshit. I'll tell you what. Just check it out. It ain't bullshit. I'm telling you right now, as a trans woman, trans women are women. What I'm telling you, as a man, that's bullshit. Uh -huh. That's all it is, bro. It is. It's totally it's bullshit. Okay. You know what? Nobody confronts your ass. That's the problem. Really? If they say, really? What the fuck? You want a bat? What the fuck? Well, There's you want a bat? You know how many people have been embarrassed? Oh, oh. So you get me? Because there is nothing else you can do for me. You are not helpful. You are hindering my life. You should just go away. You get me? Because the truth between us, the truth between us, the truce between us is null and void. Bitch, I'll never forgive you for this. The, you don't understand how humanity worked. We had an agreement that, hey, I won't kill you, you won't kill me, and we can live in harmony. But when you mess harmony up, what it's an, what incentive, incentive do a person have for agreeing with your safety. You get me? And this is not a battle cry for anybody to do anything. You get me? This disclaimer, disclaimer, disclaimer. This is me telling you the agreement between people. As the crime rises, you have to understand that it's because of the lack of respect. The agreed upon truce is being null and voided. 
Every day I have to participate in this charade. Every day I have to pretend that this man is a woman. Is a day that you take away all that humans stand for. Go to Harvard to know what you're doing. You know what I'm trying to say to you, man? Do you? Yes, you do. Well, then shut the fuck up. Lying through your fucking teeth. I know it. You know it. And this fucking hoe know it. Come on, leave me alone. Yeah? Yeah? We stand for truth. We stand for honesty. We stand for respect. You get me? We, unlike other animals, are capable of controlling our natural urges. That is what separates us from animals. The future is shit. Just like the past. <laughs> You get me? But when you take away the line between man and woman and animal and human, there is no reason this shouldn't happen. You get me? Because if I'm an animal now, because I have to continue to live as an animal, you get me? Being scared, hustling, scrounging. You get what I'm saying? Having a lie, heathen like. You get me? Watching all this sex and all this nakedness around me. The way you treat kids. Y'all aborting babies like they fucking fetuses and that you're calling them such. Men can have babies and anybody can dress any way you, they want and things without rules in this world. Cops killing people, people killing cops. Where is the humanity at? Or are we back to our basic instincts as animals? Then why don't we just kill each other now? Your intellect is as weak as your dollar. Failure is your destiny. You disrespect yourself and your nation. You are made of stupid. I gotta talk about this shit because I still hold values that humans used to have. I would love to continue being a human around other human beings, but you can't because around those other people, I would call them Neanderthals, you know, because uh, or because they're more regressive than actual uh, uh, Homo sapiens. Because I, I I consider myself a Homo sapien. You get me the evolved form of these so-called Neanderthals who want to just continue in their lustful behavior and their pretentious worldviews and shit like that. I don't have that. I don't have that in me. I'm a human being. You get me? I'm not an animal. You get what I'm saying? Which is why y'all went instinct. Because once humans understood and once humans, homo sapiens came around, those Neanderthals are gone. But, but since y'all want to so-called suppress my homo sapien nature and try to try to turn me into a Neanderthal, why are we just killing each other now? Like, what's up, danger? I don't even know if that makes sense to a lot of people. But, uh, as you can see, cock and balls, cock and balls. Can't hide your cock and balls. Anyway. <laughs> Bye.